Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. And today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a an army beret look good. So this is a couple of different berets, you know, that you earn throughout your military career. But the first one you ever, uh, you know, earn is this black beret. So this is the one that you get for finishing uh, either basic training or AIT. You get it issued to you like right when you get to, uh, you know, whatever station you're gonna do basic training at. But this is the, the standard beret that everybody gets. And you get it with this weird, super long, funky looking block that's up in the front. It looks like this, right? So if you look inside it, uh, it comes with something that it's a lot bigger than this. It comes kind of like a half circle and it's it's up right here. And that looks fucking nasty. So like either your drill sergeants will tell you uh, like how to cut it, you know, like this. If you have the time, even if your drill sergeants don't like tell you or whatever, cut it like this, like, so this is uh, the little outline for the flash that's on it, the blue flash. Uh, so just cut, like, I don't know, like a nail, a nail size around it and then make it, that way it looks a lot nicer. So whenever you cut that, you know, you're gonna have this string in the back as well. This is to like tie it up to your head, to your big ass head. Whenever you wear a braid, you never want this to show. Uh, you know, when you tie it up in the back, so, so either cut it or just like hide, tuck it in and hide it under. That's what I did. I just tucked it in. But another thing you want to do is actually shave it. So like legit, you fucking shave it. So you grab a razor and you just shave it. Uh, a lot of people tell you to use a single razor, but you know, I've used a three razor and a five blade razor on my berets and they do and they work properly. All you gotta do is make sure you, you do it slow and you don't have put in too much uh, pressure because I will cut it and make holes in it. So when you shape it, what you wanna do is actually wet it. You wanna wet it with hot water. So just dunk it in some hot water and then you gotta put it on your head, right? The flash always goes above your left thigh. So make sure it's centered above your left thigh and then pull your right, your right side down. It might look like the left side on the video, but it's on your right side. So just pull it in like this and then fucking comb it and then just comb it over like a fucking ugly ass haircut and then naturally it, it should make a little crease right here going up to the flash and then what you want to do is just tuck it in if it doesn't actually like tuck it in help it out make it form and then pull your little your braid just just slightly over the the corner of the flash and then just keep pulling it just pull it you know obviously when it's hot and wet it'll look it'll be a lot nicer than you know for me but you gotta make sure there's no wrinkles, no nothing on the, uh, you know, on this side. Just make it all go down, pull it down, blah, blah, blah. And regulation says you can't have it under your, you know, tip of your ear or whatever this is called. So as long as it doesn't pass that, you're good. You can just keep pulling it down as far as possible. You know, pull your flash down a little bit. But in basic, uh, we were told it has to be one inch over your eyebrows and then it has to be parallel. So everything is parallel, right, to the marching surface. Just tuck it in like that, and then boom. Your beret should look something like this. If you do it properly, you know, it should have that little tuck, and then it should fold over the flash, and then just bring it down, shave it, you know, shave it the inside, shave the outside, make it look nice. Uh, if you reach the little swirly lines, obviously you don't want to go past that because that's the actual threading of the, the what makes the beret. If you go past that, you'll make a hole and destroy it. And that's how you make a beret. So I don't wear this beret. This is my basic beret. I wore it like once. This is what my real beret looks like. We got that maroon airborne beret, right? It's got my flash. As you can see, it only goes down to about half of my ear length. You got that little V right here. It goes over my flash just a little bit. And, and there's no wrinkles or anything. It's, it's just flat go straight you can see my head my perfect little head and in the back i don't have the uh the string i actually took the string off so i'm i'm just about to sew uh these little two sections together so it looks closed and i can just wear it on my head just like that boom and that's pretty neat but yeah that's it i hope this helps y'all you know just a little bit of beret info info how to uh you know make it look a little bit nicer hope y'all enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like and subscribe let me know what you thought and let me know which beret you like better the maroon one or the black one obviously i gotta go with the maroon one bro all right that's gonna be it guys peace